I'm a huge horror movie fan. Oh, by the way, I put on a different color shirt today just for you guys. I'm a huge horror movie fan, but, like, you couldn't make the horror movies I grew up watching today. Like, I feel like technology would just ruin the scariness of them. Like, Poltergeist. You couldn't have Carol Ann getting sucked into the TV. It's not believable, because, first of all, no one even watches TV anymore. Especially people under 30. You'd have Carol Ann get sucked into an iPad. They're here! Well, get them out! I'm trying to check my Facebook. They'd go to the Apple Store, some millennials hitting buttons. This tablet is clear. I know they remade Poltergeist in 2014, but it sucks so bad I, I don't count it. So let's pretend that didn't happen. You couldn't make I Know What You Did Last Summer. I know what you did last summer. How? Bitch, I follow you on Instagram. I know what you had for breakfast. Freddy, I love Freddy. I fucking love Freddy. I love how Freddy makes a bad joke before he kills somebody. He's like a bad comedian. He'll pop out of the refrigerator. Did someone cut the cheese? You're a real asshole, Freddy. Just, just get it over with. But Freddy couldn't kill people now because every kid's hopped up on Adderall and Red Bull. They never fall asleep. Freddy's just in dreamland waiting. How long does this shit take to wear off? We got 15 more sequels to film. Jason's coming over. I gotta fight his ass. Let's go. And I hate Friday the 13th. First of all, first of all, Friday the 13th, on a side note, every Friday the 13th, someone busts in the police station. Jason's back. They're like, you're not talking about the legend, are you? I'm like, legend, this shit happens every fucking year. Every year he kills all the counselors at Crystal Lake on Friday the 13th. It's not a legend if it's really happening. You couldn't make Blair Witch Project today. Everyone's got GPS on their phone. That movie would be called Get Google Maps Before Blair Witch Kills You. You couldn't make paranormal activity. It wouldn't even be scary. The fucking witch starts doing shit. They're just making Snapchat videos. Can you pop out again? I didn't get that last one. Hey, make more footprints. Hey, I put cat ears on the demon. Look at it. <laughs> you couldn't make these horror movies, dude. They'd be stupid. I don't know. Halloween's my favorite horror movie. Hall the original one, not the Rob Zombie one. I didn't like that one that much. I felt like the pacing was too fast. But every Halloween... Why, first of all, why are they still trick-or-treating? Why are they still going? <laughs> every Halloween, Michael Myers kills everyone in Haddonfield, Illinois. First of all, why do they still live in that town? Move your ass to Chicago. They're having a Halloween parade. People are dressed like Michael Myers. They're like, I hope he comes this week. This Halloween, I'm trying to get his autograph. I hope he kills me. I've seen all his films. I'm his biggest fan. I'm just watching Friday the 13th Part 6, Jason Lives in my other room with my fire stick because it has all these 80s movies. The First of all, I love the movie, but the script is so stupid. Like, why do we give Oscar awards to people in really good movies with great directors and great scripts? You should give these people Oscars. Can you imagine having to be a fucking, be like, Jason's coming. He's got a knife. He's going to kill us all. Jason, like, you have to be the best actor to actually say these lines without laughing. What's the line? Jason's in the shower. He just killed Megan. I, dude, I can't fucking say this shit. How many sequels is that? That guy should get an Oscar. Jason's outside. Ah! Ah! That's the Oscar clip. The nominees are Simon Periwinkle for Friday the 13th, part 19. Jason's coming! Ah! Give his ass the Oscar. Okay, that's my rant for today, everyone. I'm going to go eat some popcorn and watch the rest of the movie. Bye!